In mathematics, a rational number is any number that can be expressed as the quotient or fraction p, q of two integers, a numerator p and a non-zero denominator q. Since q may be equal to 1, every integer is a rational number. The set of all rational numbers, often referred to as the rationals. The field of rationals or the field of rational numbers is usually denoted by a boldface Q or blackboard bold Q. Display style math B Q. Unicode. It was thus denoted in 1895 by Giuseppe Pino after quotiente, Italian for quotient. The decimal expansion of a rational number always either terminates after a finite number of digits or begins to repeat the same finite sequence of digits over and over. Moreover, any repeating or terminating decimal represents a rational number. These statements hold true not just for base 10, but also for any other integer base, e.g., binary, hexadecimal. A real number that is not rational is called irrational. Irrational numbers include square root 2, pi, e, and phi. The decimal expansion of an irrational number continues without repeating. Since the set of rational numbers is countable, and the set of real numbers is uncountable, almost all real numbers are irrational. Rational numbers can be formally defined as equivalence classes of pairs of integers p, q, such that q does not equal zero, for the equivalence relation defined by p1, q1, tilde, p2. Q2 if and only if P1 Q2 equals P2 Q1 with this formal definition the fraction P Q becomes the standard notation for the equivalence class of P Q rational numbers together with addition and multiplication form a field which contains the integers and is contained in any field containing the integers in other words, the field of rational numbers is a prime field, and a field has characteristic zero if and only if it contains the rational numbers as a subfield. Finite extensions of Q are called algebraic number fields, and the algebraic closure of Q is the field of algebraic numbers. In mathematical analysis, the rational numbers form a dense subset of the real numbers. The real numbers can be constructed from the rational numbers by completion, using Cauchy sequences, Dedekind cuts, or infinite decimals. Topic. Terminology The term rational in reference to the set Q refers to the fact that a rational number represents a ratio of two integers. In mathematics, rational is often used as a noun abbreviating rational number. The adjective rational sometimes means that the coefficients are rational numbers. For example, a rational point is a point with rational coordinates that is a point whose coordinates are rational numbers, a rational matrix is a matrix of rational numbers, a rational polynomial may be a polynomial with rational coefficients, although the term polynomial over the rationals is generally preferred, for avoiding confusion with rational expression and rational function. A polynomial is a rational expression and defines a rational function, even if its coefficients are not rational numbers. However, a rational curve is not a curve defined over the rationals, but a curve which can be parameterized by rational functions. Topic: 
Arithmetic Topic irreducible fraction Every rational number may be expressed in a unique way as an irreducible fraction a, b, where a and b are coprime integers, and b greater than zero. This is often called the canonical form. Starting from a rational number a, b, its canonical form may be obtained by dividing a and b by their greatest common divisor, and, if b. Topic. Embedding of integers Any integer n can be expressed as the rational number n, 1, which is its canonical form as a rational number. Topic. Equality A B equals C D display style frac a b equals frac C D if and only if a D equals B C display style add equals B C if both fractions are in canonical form then a b equals c d display style frac a b equals frac c d if and only if o equals c display style a equals c and b equals d display style b equals d topic ordering if both denominators are positive and in particular if both fractions are in canonical form a b c d display style frac a b if and only if a d b c display style add if either denominator is negative each fraction with a negative denominator must first be converted into an equivalent form with a positive denominator by changing the signs of both its numerator and denominator topic addition Two fractions are added as follows A B plus C D equals A D plus B C B D Display style FRAC A B plus FRAC C D equals FRAC add plus B C B D. If both fractions are in canonical form, the result is in canonical form if and only if B and D are coprime integers. Topic Subtraction A B minus C D equals A D minus B C B D Display style FRAC A B FRAC C D equals FRAC add B C B D. If both fractions are in canonical form, the result is in canonical form if and only if B and D are coprime integers.
Topic: Multiplication. The rule for multiplication is a b c d equals a c b d display style frac a b c d o t frac c d equals frac a c b d even if both fractions are in canonical form, the result may be a reducible fraction. Topic Inverse Every rational number a, b has an additive inverse, often called its opposite. Minus a b equals minus a b display style left frac a b right equals frac a b if a b is in canonical form the same is true for its opposite a non-zero rational number a, b has a multiplicative inverse, also called its reciprocal a b minus 1 equals b a Display style left frac a b right caret minus one equals frac b a. If a b is in canonical form, then the canonical form of its reciprocal is either b a display style frac b a or minus B minus a display style frac b a depending on the sign of a topic division. If both b and c are non-zero, the division rule is a b c d equals a d b c display style frac frac a b frac c d equals frac add b c Thus, dividing a, b by c, d is equivalent to multiplying a, b by the reciprocal of c, d a d b c equals a b d c Display style FRAC add BC equals FRAC A B C D O T FRAC D C Topic Exponentiation to integer power If N is a non negative integer, then A B N equals A N B N Display style left FRAC A B right carrot N equals FRAC a carrot N B carrot N The result is in canonical form if the same is true for A B in particular a b 0 equals 
1 Display style left FRAC A B right carrot zero equals one. If a does not equal zero, then A B minus N equals B N A N Display style left FRAC A B right carrot N equals FRAC B carrot N A carrot N. If A B is in canonical form, the canonical form of the result is B N A N display style frac b caret n a caret n if either a greater than 0 or n is even otherwise the canonical form of the result is minus b n minus a n Display style FRAC B carrot N a carrot N. Topic Continued fraction representation. A finite continued fraction is an expression such as a zero plus one a one plus one a two plus one plus one a n Display style underscore zero plus CFRAC one O underscore one plus CFRAC one O underscore two plus CFRAC one D dots plus CFRAC one O underscore N Where in air integers Every rational number a, b can be represented as a finite continued fraction, whose coefficients and can be determined by applying the Euclidean algorithm to a, b. Topic: Other representations. Common fraction. Eight. 3 display style frac 8 3 mixed numeral 2 2 3 display style 2 tfrac 2 3 repeating decimal using a vinculum 2 6 Display style two overline six. Repeating decimal using parentheses. Two six. Display style two six. Continued fraction using traditional topography. Two plus one one plus. One two Display style two plus CFRAC one one plus CFRAC one two Continued fraction in abbreviated notation two one two Egyptian fraction two plus one two plus one six Display style two plus FRAC one two plus FRAC one six Prime power decomposition two 
3 times 3 minus 1 display style 2 caret 3 times 3 caret minus 1 Quote notation, 3, 6 are different ways to represent the same rational value. Topic. Formal construction The rational numbers may be built as equivalence classes of ordered pairs of integers. More precisely, let z times z zero be the set of the pairs m n of integers such n does not equal zero. An equivalence relation is defined on this set by m one n one tilde m two n two if and only if m one n two equals m two n one. Addition and multiplication can be defined by the following rules M one N one plus M two N two M one N two plus N one M two N one N two Display style left M underscore one N underscore one right plus left M underscore two N underscore two right a quiv left M underscore one N underscore two plus N underscore one M underscore two N underscore one N underscore two right M one N one times M two N two M one M two N one N two Display style left M underscore one N underscore one right times left M underscore two N underscore two right a quiv left M underscore one M underscore two N underscore one N underscore two right this equivalence relation is a congruence relation, which means that it is compatible with the addition and multiplication defined above. The set of rational numbers Q is the defined as the quotient set by this equivalence relation, z times z zero tilde, equipped with the addition and the multiplication induced by the above operations. This construction can be carried out with any integral domain and produces its field of fractions. The equivalence class of a pair M, N, is denoted M N displaystyle FRAC M N two pairs M1, N1 and M2, N2 belong to the same equivalence class that is are equivalent if and only if M1 N2 equals M2 N1 Display style M underscore one N underscore two equals M underscore two N underscore one. This means that M one N one equals M two N 
2 display style frac m underscore 1 n underscore 1 equals frac m underscore 2 n underscore 2 if and only m 1 n 2 equals m 2 n 1 display style m underscore 1 n underscore 2 equals m underscore 2 n underscore 1 every equivalence class m n display style frac m n may be represented by infinitely many pairs since equals minus 2 m minus 2 n equals minus m minus n equals m n equals 2 M two N equals Display style C D O T S equals F R A C minus two meters two N equals F R A C M N equals F R A C M N equals F R A C two meters two N equals C D O T S it is often convenient to choose, once for all, in each equivalence class a specific element called the canonical representative element. This canonical representative is the unique pair M, N, in the equivalence class such that M and N are coprime, and M zero. It is called the representation in lowest terms of the rational number. The integers may be considered to be rational numbers identifying the integer n with the rational number n 1 display style frac n 1 a total order may be defined on the rational numbers that extends the natural order of the integers 1 has m1 n1 m2 n2 display style frac m underscore 1 n underscore 1 leq frac m underscore 2 n underscore 2 if m1 n2 n1 meter 2 if n1 n2 greater than 0 or m1 n2 n1 meter 2 if n1 n2 o display style M underscore one N underscore two L E Q N underscore one M underscore two quad text if quad N underscore one N underscore two greater than zero quad text or quad M underscore one N underscore two G E Q N underscore one M underscore two quad text if quad N underscore one N underscore two Topic properties The set Q, together with the addition and multiplication operations shown above, forms a field, the field of fractions of the integers Z. The rationals are the smallest field with characteristic zero, every other field of characteristic zero contains a copy of Q. The rational numbers are therefore the prime field for characteristic zero. The algebraic closure of Q, i.e. the field of roots of rational polynomials, is the algebraic numbers. The set of all rational numbers is countable. Since the set of all real numbers is uncountable, we say that almost all real numbers are irrational, in the sense of Lebesgue measure, i.e. the set of rational numbers is a null set. 
the rationals are a densely ordered set, between any two rationals, there sits another one, and, therefore, infinitely many other ones. For example, for any two fractions such that a b c d display style frac a b where b d display style b d are positive, we have a b a d plus b c two b d c d display style frac a b any totally ordered set which is countable dense in the above sense and has no least or greatest element as order isomorphic to the rational numbers topic <laughs> real numbers and topological properties The rationals are a dense subset of the real numbers, every real number has rational numbers arbitrarily close to it. A related property is that rational numbers are the only numbers with finite expansions as regular continued fractions. By virtue of their order, the rationals carry an order topology. The rational numbers, as a subspace of the real numbers, also carry a subspace topology. The rational numbers form a metric space by using the absolute difference metric d x, y. Topic x minus y, and this yields a third topology on Q. All three topologies coincide and turn the rationals into a topological field. The rational numbers are an important example of a space which is not locally compact. The rationals are characterized topologically as the unique countable metrizable space without isolated points. The space is also totally disconnected. The rational numbers do not form a complete metric space, the real numbers are the completion of Q under the metric D X, y. X minus Y above. Topic P adic numbers. In addition to the absolute value metric mentioned above, there are other metrics which turn Q into a topological field. Let P be a prime number and for any non-zero integer a, let a p equals p minus n, where p n is the highest power of p dividing a. In addition set, 0, p. Topic, 0. For any rational number a, b, we set, a, b, p. A, P, B, P. Then D, P, X, Y equals, X minus Y, P defines a metric on Q. The metric space Q, D, P is not complete, and its completion is the P adic number field Q, P. Ostrowski's theorem states that any non-trivial absolute value on the rational numbers Q is equivalent to either the usual real absolute value or a p-adic absolute value. Topic. See also. Floating point. Ford circles. Niven's theorem Rational data type Height of a rational number in lowest term equals naive height Gaussian rational <laughs>